Hi, I'm David. Welcome again to Wildlife in Focus. There are three species of British wagtails. The white wagtail, grey wagtail, and yellow wagtail. In this bird identification guide, we explore each species, including tips to ID the birds in the field and a brief overview of habitat. The pied wagtail is also called the white wagtail, scientific name Motetsila alba. The white wagtail is the most easily recognisable bird in this lineup and the most common of the three species of bird from a UK viewpoint. Climate change is thought to have helped pied wagtails and their populations have steadily increased. The white wagtail can be found across the entirety of the British Isles, including higher ground in the warmer months. They can be found in pretty much any environment, including urban areas. If you live in the city, you may be lucky enough to see flocks of pied wagtails during the winter as they take advantage of inner city warmer air temperatures. White wagtails are monochromatic, consisting of the colors black, white, and gray. They have long tails, and as their name suggests, when perched, their tails are almost constantly on the move. White wagtails fly with an undulating pattern and are often accompanied by their high pitched call. Key features to look out for are black cap and bib, white markings on their underparts and cheeks, black tail feathers framed in white, brown coloured legs. It's possible to distinguish males and females as males have jet black backs, heads and breasts, whereas the females on the other hand are slightly more grey. The black colouring is particularly noticeable in males during the breeding season. Juvenile white wagtails have been known to confuse with other bird species as their markings are much less pronounced than adults. In particular, their backs are often brown. The grey wagtail, scientific name Motacilla cinerea, is significantly more colourful than its name suggests as they have bright yellow underparts. For this reason, they are often confused with the yellow wagtail. The grey wagtail likes to make its presence known. They can be found in a varied range of habitats, though water bodies are their favoured location. They can be found across the British Isles, but their numbers are significantly less than that of the white wagtail. Their call is often described as explosive and can be heard above the sound of even the fastest flowing torrents of water. It is certainly worth learning about their different call signs, as it is one of the most definitive indicators that there is a grey wagtail in the area. Key features to look out for are slate greybacks and black wings, yellow underparts, pink or brown legs, black beak, comparably long tail feathers compared to the other resident wagtails in the British Isles. Males have brighter yellow breast feathers than the females and also sport a black bib, which is absent on the females, though this is most noticeable during the breeding season. Juvenile birds resemble adult females, but with a pinky buff lower mandible and no black markings. Yellow wagtails, scientific name Motacilla flava, are only resident in the British Isles during the breeding season, and for the main part, you will only spot them on the east coast and central belt of England. During the winter months, yellow wagtails migrate to Africa. Habitat-wise, you are most likely to see the yellow wagtail on pastoral land, as well as in marshes and reed beds. Their call is somewhat sweeter and less piercing than that of the grey wagtail, and is therefore a good differentiator between the two species. Key features to look out for are olive green upper parts, bright yellow underparts, brown legs. They tend to hold themselves somewhat more upright than the grey wagtail. 
their tail feathers are significantly shorter than that of the grey wagtail. It can be difficult to tell males from females with this species, especially outside of the breeding season, though males tend to be brighter yellow than females. Juvenile birds are similar in colouring to adult females. I hope you enjoyed this guide. Let us know in the comments below and consider subscribing as it really helps the channel.